<laughs> All right, now just need to open this thing so I can keep an eye on the chat. Okay, this should be this should be good. Yo, Evan Scott, welcome to the stream. Ben K, hey guys, hope you're doing well. <laughs> Just a second to figure stuff out. Hey, Bogdan, welcome to the stream. <laughs> Cairo Khan, yes, we'll do that. We'll play some Cairo. So, by the way, guys, feel free to send uh, send over some challenges. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> Go ahead on my profile and, uh, yeah, make sure to challenge. Link is in the chat right now because I'm about to play some viewers. I mean, if you guys want to play me, it's like, that's okay. If you don't want to play, I can just, like, close the stream. Uh yeah, make sure it's like three zero, something like that. It's uh it's chess.com guys, so uh I just sent a link um uh, that you can get to my profile. Okay, three two, let's uh warm up with this. Oh, we've got D4. We don't get that very often, do we? <laughs> Oh, what a surprise already. Um, wait, so how do we do this? There's like a, there's like a trap. Hey, thank you for that, Sabi here. <laughs> hmm. Okay, let's uh, try the same. So yeah, guys, if you want a challenge, make sure to use uh, this link from the chat and challenge in, uh, in Blitz. So no Rapids. <laughs> I know a lot of you may be playing Rapids. Wait, what am I doing? This is like not even, not even like trapping his bishop. I thought uh, we're like getting the trap, but the bishop's like going home. What am I doing? This is embarrassing. What is this nonsense that we play right now? <laughs> Just trying to go too hard on my 700 rated opponent. Uh, by the way, let me know if like the sound is fine. I can actually check. Uh, but uh, yeah, I haven't streamed in like a while, but everything should be, should be okay. Okay, e3, there it is, but it's no longer like losing now because the knight's there. Oh my. Okay, I'm gonna go for the trap and uh, fingers crossed. Hey, Peter, welcome to the stream, guys. Let me know if you're like first time on the stream. We haven't like streamed in a while, so. I believe I actually just doubled the sub count uh, since the last time we had a stream, so. I think there's some chances we've got some new people uh, on the stream. Everything is good. Thanks for letting me know. So yeah, just trying to develop here. Nothing really special since the opening of this game has been like really embarrassing, but uh, we'll just try to recover after that. Idea to cast along. So um, yeah, feel free to... Go ahead, challenge me. I see you guys sent already like a few challenges, which I'm uh, about to take. <laughs> first time, first time, first time. We've got like at least uh, <clears throat> three first timers. Okay, with that is four. <laughs> Hmm. 
All right, how do we play this one? Why is the opponent playing good moves? Thank you for that, Dean. Glad you're enjoying like the London playlist. And by the way, guys, just because um, we're all here, if you by any chance have my London system course, you can actually vote me on the uh, offer of the year kind of thing. That's yeah, something that I care about. So you could uh, fill in that survey by using the link from the chat. Of course, only if you have the course, not like, you know, we don't want to like blackmail any votes or stuff like that. You want to win it like uh, by a fair margin, of course. He takes with a knight. Opponent doesn't, uh, doesn't believe my crap. Damn it. I wanted to bluff him, but he just took it. Now I have nothing. <laughs> so I'm just worse. Uh, I mean, I've been worse for like since the beginning of the game, which is a bit embarrassing, but you guys like still help me anyways. Not that I care, but uh -huh. we can try out some Vienna for sure. We could do that, but I mean, we're just warming up with a London. <laughs> Have I played Eric? I played Eric Hansen. I'm, I, I don't think I ever played like Eric Rosen. If that's uh, your Eric. But I, I did play Eric Hansen like maybe two times. And got crashed. So. <laughs> um. Yeah, I mean, Jabapa is fine too. Like, the normal London. Okay, that's it's good if you can manage it. But uh, if not, then... You always know the Jabava is waiting for you. So <laughs> the Jabava London is like kind of like your family. It's always gonna be there for you. Unless, you know, like the London, the normal one. Sometimes just staying uh, with you when you're like on a good streak. Then these openings uh, let you down sometimes. <laughs> mm. In Queen G3, we just need to like uh, open up the uh, the position somehow. Is there any way to do that? I mean, there should be. You just uh, get knights around. And the idea is like pretty simple next. We just want to try to sack, maybe rook h3 is there, I was also considering g5, g4, but felt like it's a bit slow, okay, that one I think, um, we cash in, and then, yeah, I could sack the rook, there's like no need to, how can I play, uh, you can use, uh, this link, guys, so let me just, uh, actually, let me bring this one up here, so, Yeah, you can send in a challenge by using the link from the chat. So, yeah, I definitely encourage you to send in a challenge because I'm just playing like random people right now. So, I'll try to play as many as, uh, as I can. I think we'll try to stream for longer than two hours. So, there should be plenty of time. Okay, let's take down an 1800. This one is a little bit of like a tougher challenge. Hey, good game, uh, Pardam. <laughs> okay, let's see if opponent is there. Tips for someone stuck at 1600? I mean, there's a lot of things you can do, obviously, but um, hmm, probably at 1600, it's already about uh, learning some serious openings. Oh, it just takes. Oh, and goes f4. All right, this is going to be interesting. This is one of the toughest lines. Getting the bishop out. Let's see what he knows. Play the four pretty fast. 
I'm just a 700. That doesn't matter. You guys uh, should still challenge. I'm going to play like anybody, no matter your rating. <laughs> so maybe you can even learn something. Probably not, but you can still send in. Just e6, preparing to win this pawn back. He gives a bishop e3, thinking of something like knight f5. Knight f5, bishop f2, though. How to, co to continue? There's always like d4 and just uh, win back the pawn. If I want to go like queen a5, uh, check the problem is uh, there is like c3, bishop c5, and then b4. So, yeah, I think that's like a little bit problematic. I think I'm just going to go knight f5, h5. Even though maybe not great. I don't know. Maybe just uh, play bishop e7. Oh, actually, now the check makes more sense because uh, we can take and then we take with a check on b4. So I changed my mind. Like b4, there's that. That should be okay. Anyways, tough line to play as black. I mean, normally when we capture the pawn, it should just be completely fine. I know this line is not like really problematic the way he played it. I think in this position, uh, it's critical to play bishop d3, but it's not like a very easy move. Yeah, you have to like really know it there. And now I think after we get in like a queen trade, it should be pretty uh, solid. Takes, takes, king f2. I probably have to play knight c4, which I'm not sure. Like, queen trade is so juicy always. Hmm. Gonna do like knight e2. I'm gonna do like. What am I actually going to do there? Yeah, I'm not sure I'm a huge fan of, uh, of this position after like knight c4. Yeah, I think I'll have to probably retreat back to f5, and if he gives up the bishop, I'm hoping to be okay there with, like, the isolated pawn. Yeah, I was expecting him to take here. Yeah, and I was hoping we could, like, uh, push d4 in time before he, like, uh, gets a firm grip over the position. Just planning to, like... Uh, I cast a long already, d4, sort of next. He wants like knight b5 or knight c2, so... I think it's time. But then that's also... He's gonna get like a knight to d6. Yeah, I'm not like a huge fan of my possession. It's just uh, slightly worse. But I guess we'll have to try to play fast. Ninety three d4. It gets knight c4, so I'll have to probably play knight e7 instead. Opponent playing pretty well so far. I mean, we'll give him that. Okay, then I'll just try to. Improve my uh, king. How is this endgame? Probably h4 important move. Fixing the pawns. I have to... Use the king. Tricky endgame. But I think b6 is in time. Should be a draw. King c5, king c3, a5. Maybe even play for a win. So a5, uh, king d3, king b4, king d4, king a4. King d5, uh, 
King b4, King d6, a4, King e7, a3, King f7, a2, e6, a1, and then the queen kind of, uh, sort of in time. Yeah, I think this was a win. I mean, I was looking at this line and, uh, yeah, I think I was like promoting faster, but, um, uh, yeah, anyways, definitely not a game I should have uh, should have won. He had a good opening. <clears throat> this is like one of the best uh, lines uh, you could play as white. Yeah, apparently queen e3 was a mistake. I'm supposed to just do queen b6, which I even consider for some weird reason, but it's hard to decide to make such move. I played uh, queen e3, I knew I'm worse, and... I mean, <clears throat> I could have gone knight c4, but I didn't like this position with knight e2. Like, we have to defend, and then the knight's coming to d6, so... Opponent had a good opening. Until... I mean... Frankly speaking, his opening was fine. Uh, was not, like, the most precise, but in general pretty solid. It's just that I could have played better here. If I, like, simply castle, I imagine. Yeah, castling is fine, and I have to just... Uh, Allow this, which is like not uh, super normal to just allow double pawns for no reason. Okay, guys, I'm trying to catch up with the chat. So feel free to send in a challenge, by the way, if you've got like any new uh, people on the stream. You can use the link from the chat to send over a challenge and I, i'll play like anybody i'm playing them in like random order so you've got a you've got a good chance and yeah make sure to do it like five minutes three minutes that's fine okay let's uh Let's take this player and uh, what do we play? Do you guys want like an E4 game? Let's do some E4. Okay, is my opponent there? Kid Curry. How do I improve my visualization? Well, have you tried training on chess? That is usually <laughs> uh, a big part that people overlook. So, okay, what do we play against the car? What do you guys like wanna wanna see? Okay, so we're gonna go d4, and let's play aggressive. Yo, D Rock, welcome to the stream. What's up? How are you? A c5 line could try play ambitious or could play like knight f3 kind of stuff. Could also just play c3. Actually, I'll try to. I, I never really play c3 in this position, but I'll try something fancy. So, um, yeah, the thing is knight f3, cd, cd, bishop g4 is what he wants. So I'll do. I'll do like a3. Just kind of wait for bishop f5. Dania always plays the fantasy. Yeah, fantasy is interesting. I mean, I even have a course on it. I could play fantasy, but just wanted to play like some advanced. Hey, thank you for voting, uh, Gaur. I really appreciate it, guys. So if by any chance um, you have my uh, chessable course on the London, you could be uh, voting your favorite offer of the year in the pinned comment. So uh, yeah, just to send you the link again in the chat. I would really appreciate the support. Just have to fill in that survey. Okay, he just takes. I'm going to play like uh, knight c3 next. Try to avoid this bishop g4 pin, which is like the main thing. He says the fantasy is the best way to play against the Karo. I think fantasy is interesting, but okay. Obviously, you're not going to get an edge with anything in like any opening so it just comes down to the surprise value and uh how well you know the upcoming positions so whether you play fantasy advanced exchange or like normal knight c3 it's all the same 
<laughs> when is the Karokana course coming out? It's supposed to be releasing in April. Uh, so still some time. I, I kind of have the lines already, but definitely need to uh, annotate them and come up with like some other chapters, which is going to be time consuming, but hopefully it's going to be done by uh, April. What did I open with? I started with E4 and we're in the Karokan. So just going to do like uh, Knight F3, Bishop E2, Castle, just try to play positional. Yeah, I mean, if they play C3, they have no idea what they're doing. That is true, but... Uh, I mean, there's, like, interesting ways to, to play it, too. Still, not for an advantage, but it's, like, an interesting idea. There are some players that do this in Blitz quite successfully. Um, like, I played against Nigel Short um, not so long ago, and he did this A3 kind of thing against me. I somehow won in, like, a lucky fashion, but I was... Um, Getting outplayed um, there. By the way, opponent playing very well so far. He's gonna cast land knight f5, bishop e3. Just very solid stuff. Okay, queen to b6. Uh, I think queen d3 is like an interesting move. Threatening knight d5. Uh, queen d3, I just have to figure it out if he can take. I mean, my intuition says that's like a losing move. Can he do it uh, with this knight? Then still something like uh, knight d5. Hmm. I know this is like super risky, what he's doing right now. I'm just like trying to remember why. Also like bishop d5 sometimes could be a thing. Um, and DD, 95, I don't know, maybe like not really in this position. So maybe queen here, he takes with this knight and then maybe bishop d5 then. I don't know, I'm just going to play queen d3. It feels like that's the move, but I uh, I haven't like really um, went over like any <laughs> concrete reply to that. Who can join uh, GameCube? Anybody can join, guys. So you can just use the... Link to my uh, chess.com profile. I posted it in the chat and uh, send the challenge over. That should be okay. Okay, bishop e7, typical mistake. Uh, just uh, allowing this little trick. And if he takes, the knight remains undefended. So that's kind of fortunate for me, but we'll have to see whether he could have taken on d4 or not. Like my intuition says not, but I'm not sure. So. It's expecting him to take back. I mean, there's not really much he can do. And probably castle after I pick up the knight. Then there's like maybe bishop d5, knight d4. Hmm. Maybe just queen g4. Be okay. No, oh, he just went back. I guess that's a move, but we can simply take. I can also just go back. Um, also, we don't have to, like, really move the knight. But I feel like taking can't be bad either. Whenever I say that, it's usually a bad move, by the way. Mm. Okay, I'm just got, not going to take. I'm just going to do rook c1. Hey, QB, it's Nick. Welcome to the stream. What's up? Some exercises to start playing blindfolded. How do chess school teach these beginners? All masters and above can do it. Dude, there is no, like, exercises you need to do for blindfolded. You just, like, spend insane uh, amounts of hours next to the chessboard, and at some point uh, you're going to find it's easier to visualize things. So uh, there's no, like, uh, I never did any exercises of stuff like that. Still, I'm not, like, a great blindfolded player, but I could, like, visualize first 20 moves kind of easily. Hey, thank you for that, Chris Chess. Welcome to the stream. Okay, what do we play? Knight e7, just pick up like the free pawn. I mean, already picked it up, but just exchanging. Hey, thank you for that, uh, Louis. Glad to help. Nice to have you live. Okay, let's see how he recaps. We've got obviously like a pretty powerful bishop. Also d5 ideas to open it up. Maybe. I mean, we don't have to, but that's, that's a theme. 
Rook fd1 could also be nice supporting this idea. Still, I've got an extra pawn. The pawn is like a, a little bit backward. Hmm. Yeah, I think we'll just have to play it a bit slow now. Uh, I think uh, there's like 95 that we could potentially be sitting on. So I'm just going to do bishop e4. Also kind of prophylactic to mid castles with bishop h7. Yeah, I play a bit of League of Legends Dirac. To be honest, I uh, I mainly I mainly watch League of Legends. I mean, if, if, if I had, if it was like by me, I would play League of Legends like 24-7. I kind of like it, but I don't really have time to play. Um... I picked up like gold four, so I'm like pretty weak, but uh, I never really like grinded league seriously, or at least that's uh, what uh, bad players find as an excuse. So uh, I think league is fun, yeah. Do you guys like play league or do you play like any other suicidal games? <laughs> I mean, obviously, chess is one of them, so hard to compete with that. Yeah, actually, the Vienna below 1,000 is actually, like, pretty cool. They, like, uh, fall for the Vienna Gambit quite often, which is nice. Okay, now we can take and uh, fix the weak pawn, start attacking. I think we do that. Double up rooks. Also, maybe we could just... I'm just going to, like, not even care about, like, the extra pawn. Come on, guys. What is, like, the highest ELO league player that we have in the chat? Are you guys all, like... Iron plebs. Even I am bronze for it right now. <laughs> we see f6 takes bishop d4. What do you do for a living? Can you live of playing and teaching chess? I'm actually thinking about releasing an OnlyFans, guys. Do you think I could financially support myself with that? Like, this is becoming pretty crazy with inflation, so. You need to be a pretty strong chess player to <laughs> survive these days. Good game, Kid Carry. Thanks for that. Uh, yeah, okay. Actually, I had a question about this game before we jump uh, into some other games. Uh, so he actually played really well. This guy like had an insane opening. Yeah, so see, Engine says white is better here after Queen D3. But, yeah, I mean, I, I, I didn't really know like, how, how we're going to proceed here. I was telling you bishop d5 is, like, kind of a common idea in these positions, but I couldn't really ma make it work. Like, take, he has to take, and then, like, knight a4 is the winning move. I mean, my intuition told me this is right, but, yeah, I mean, I, I just had to, like, calculate in this position. I wouldn't, like, really recommend you just hang a pawn and then, like, play based on your intuition, but... Uh, you guys need to do as I say, not as I do, so. <laughs> uh, I don't really, like, play uh, a lot of chess in my free time, uh, so it's mainly when I do content, and uh, I usually like to listen to music, like anything that's, like, trending here in Romania or... Yeah, like kind of the trending stuff usually. Uh, okay, let's pick some other games. Oh, oh, don't click decline all. Okay, let's do this one. Okay, so D4, how do we tackle with these kind of like d4 openings i used to play on uh europe north on uh, league of legends and i, I still play there <laughs> so maybe you guys can actually take me down on the reef. like we, we could do a league stream at some point now, now i'm like climbing actually like in bronze form i can confidently say i'm smurfing on some of these kids <laughs> if that's a flex <laughs> It's like flexing because you can beat 500. Okay, so c6. Let's see what he plays. Oh, he plays knight c3. Damn it. I was hoping we could get in like the cheap trick with a3 g5. 
Man, why do I have to play against the, the London system every single time? This is... I, I, I can't. I want to get, like, an interesting game, but... Oh, my whole life, the London system. Jeez. Knight f3, just uh, gonna get my bishop out. A league stream sounds cool. Yeah, it is like a very cool idea until you see how I actually play, so. <laughs> but I actually did, uh, did like an interesting thing uh, in my recent League of Legends games that I, uh, I muted my uh, teammates, which was actually good <laughs> now important not to go knight d7 blundering knight f7 in these positions so it's nice to play queen c7 first just making sure the bishop's defended and then we want to like uh, challenge this knight on e5 yo leon welcome to the stream what's up it's a good opening against d4 i would recommend the slav especially the reverse london if you guys are already playing the london system did you see jobaba accused the uh... Xiu Yang Yu of cheating. No, I actually haven't uh, haven't got the time to uh, look at that. So I don't know, guys. You tell me about it. Okay, guys. Now this I think could be an instructive moment because a lot of uh, you may be getting to like some kind of positions like this, and the key is to think about e4 square. And uh, because this is like no longer that annoying because f4 is restricting the bishop. You can safely move this, try to exchange this, play 94, establish control over that square, and uh, we should be pretty comfortable. I normally only play jungle in League of Legends, so the only champions that I like barely know how to play are uh, Amumu and uh, Ramos, so <laughs> don't expect much. I actually tried a little bit of Heimer mid, but it's like kind of hard to carry it. When is it okay to put the queen on the, the opposite color square? I don't get that question. Like, the queen doesn't have to stay on its color. It's only, like, at the beginning of the game, so... I think that may come from somebody that's, like, a newer player, which is, like, completely fine, but, uh... Yeah, your queen doesn't have to stay on the same color. It's... It's pointless. <laughs> Jobava seemed pretty mad. I mean, Jobava is always mad, so... There's nothing new. Yo, we've got, uh, I think, the newest Romanian Grandmaster in the chat. I mean, that's kind of, like, hard to really confuse since Romania doesn't have a whole lot of Grandmasters, but uh, Duku Gavilescu from the chat is a GM, guy. So you actually have a strong player in this stream. I mean, not literally in the stream, but uh, in the chat. So very nice to have him here, who is also, like, casual League of Legends player. So, um... Uh, <laughs> Maybe we should have a stream with him playing League of Legends. I don't know. But we used to play and that was... That was fun in the good old days. Can you make a review on Gotham Chess new video about Scholars made? I haven't like watched that yet, but I mean, what can you really review about the Scholars checkmate? It's not like really something that Alpha Zero can like recreate, I assume, so... I, I mean, it depends. I'll have to, like, watch the video first. You never know what, like, Levy is up to. So, <laughs> could in fact be something, like, quite innovative. Mm. By the way, guys, uh, if you want to give a challenge, you can use the link from the chat right now. I'm just going to, like, post it. And, yeah, use the link. Challenge me. And also, if by any chance uh, you've got my London System course, please feel free to vote me for the course of the year because they just, like, started these things. So, um, yeah. Or if you have the course, guys, I mean, we don't want to, like, invade the votes and uh, people that don't have the course. We cannot do that. <laughs> All right. Don't want to get banned on Chessable. <laughs> do you prefer bishops or knights? I mean, that's um, not about, like, really personal preference. It's just, like, kind of... Proven by science that bishops are a little bit better. Like um, in some books, uh, they are even referred to, let's say, bishop and knight uh, both being worth around like three points. But uh, what I think it's true is that the knight is worth like three points and the bishop is worth like uh, three points in the quarter. So, like, just very tiny better. Not a lot, but you really want to keep that in mind as a beginner.
have I challenged other streamers? Yeah, I played against um, other streamers, not against Anna Kremlin specifically, now that you asked, but uh, I don't know. <laughs> we were actually supposed to have a collab with uh, Nemo, but uh, that actually never ended up happening, so that was kind of the biggest collab that we were about to have, but it's gone. Down the drain. <laughs> uh, too bad. Just imagine. It would have been even better than collecting all of these guys' pieces. League of Legends with the viewers? Wait. I feel like you guys uh, just want to troll me. But maybe we could do like a flex queue. I don't know. I feel like a lot of you, though, are on the NA region, which I'm not having an account on. So I'll just to bring uh, time to bring the pieces. Is there any chance uh, to see you and Levy play or collaborate in a video? I mean, after I reach, like, let's say 100k subs, it's going to be, like, pretty tough for them to ignore me, I guess. So um, that is, like, the plan. Mm, I missed the like London question, guys. So if there's like anything specific that I uh, that I miss from the chat, I mean, uh, please understand that I'm not like ignoring you, but simply missing the messages. So it's kind of tough to keep up with everything and play in the same time. Even though that's sort of my job, and I should be decent at it. I mean, who expects people to be decent at their jobs nowadays? I mean, that is just like uh, not how the world works. Okay, let's get a new one. Guys, I'm playing uh, random people from the <laughs> whoever challenges, so it won't help if you like tell me your, your nicknames. I'm just playing um, anyone, really. <laughs> ah, th th this makes me go mad. Bro, <laughs> that's like the third London system game. What else are we like supposed to even play? Um... Just gonna go like knight f6, play c5, develop. Um, okay, I'm just gonna go for like a quick queen b6. Oh, this guy's actually... <laughs> he knows what he's doing. He knows what he's doing. This guy knows what's up. Will I be streaming on YouTube from now on? I mean, probably if I have to stream, I'll be streaming on YouTube, yes. But um, I'm not gonna be like streaming for the most part. It's mainly gonna be the videos, but... Uh, I mainly wanted to stream to like uh, hang out with you guys and also to yeah let you know vote me for course of the year. You better do that. I mean, if you haven't and I find out, you're gonna get banned. <laughs> Punish London system players with angling gambit. Yeah, I, I mean I should if they play like D four. That's like sure thing. It's um, it's like um. It's like a London, right? I mean, what am I expecting people to like play C4? Apparently we don't that do that here. I mean, I guess I'm the one that uh <laughs> I taught you guys to play this way, so I shouldn't be like really that mad in the first place, but still. Uh okay, now I'm just gonna go um E6. Just uh, try to, I mean, play crazy is not really the answer here. So we're just going to like casually develop, respect my uh, opponent, okay? He's a very well-educated 1200 opponent. So not going to do anything crazy. Just try to play the position as it is. And it could be playing C4 sooner or later. Hey, thank you for that, uh, Graham Evans. Appreciate it. Cheers to South Africa. Accept my challenge and I will open C4. That is already scary in itself. So if anything, that's downgraded your <laughs> chances. <laughs> Opening reveal. You shouldn't do that. <laughs> According to Anxious, my win rate uh, against the England is like 80%. 
Yeah, you guys should be scoring well against the England. I mean, what's wrong with you if you're not? <laughs> okay, I feel like C4 should be good in this position. I don't really like play this way against the London, but uh, yeah, I mean, I, I guess it works. <laughs> yeah, guys, so if you want a challenge, anyone could send a challenge. Just uh, use the link from my profile. And yeah, just wait. Send a challenge, fingers crossed. Go to the church in the meantime, and uh, you may be getting uh, picked. So, B3 is quite instructive because after Bishop A3, there shouldn't be any way for him to defend against. Uh, that's when we win the exchange. Hey, glad uh, to help uh, B4. When would you play King's Indian? I could have played King's Indian actually against London. I, I actually have a pretty interesting line to refute the London in the King's Indian. No, I actually don't speak any Russian. So Romanians don't speak Russian like at all. So it's probably like um, more like Serbian people or stuff like that nearby that speak more Russian than we do. Um, Okay, just uh, no need to rush with anything. It's actually pretty funny how my bishops are like completely destroying his rook. That's like a pretty funny theme that uh, you could do with the white pieces even in the London, but here I got like a little bit of a better version since I managed to expand on the queen side. Um... I'm not even super sure why this ended up happening, but I guess just he is supposed to do knight h4. That's like the only interesting move for white kind of, but still not giving an advantage last time I checked. Uh, so yeah, not even taking the rook. The pawns are better than the exchange. Well, I mean, Moldova is different. In Moldova, everyone's speaking Russian and Moldova is like kind of belongs to Russia. So... <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna collect the pawns. I mean, we don't really need the rook. Now I could be taking the rook, for instance, and then like grab another. That's like easier. Knight c2 ideas. Oh, there's nothing wrong with g5. It's just that I have so many good moves. I could do whatever. At this point, any move wins. I wouldn't like weaken my king, though. The game is won anyways. I don't need like that piece and weaken my king. Seems like half of the people I play against uh, play London. That's actually quite uh, quite fair. Uh, could also be like 30-40%, but a lot of people play London below 1,000 at least. So that I know for a fact. A lot of my students, I mean, I can see that in their stats. <laughs> okay, opponent uh, looking for the resign button, I assume. Knight c2. You know, he could play this on. I mean, I don't mind, but it was just like taking a lot of time. Queen b2, I'm playing c3 even. Yo, thank you for the five gifters. Really appreciate that, uh, dear. That is very kind of you, sir. No, that is very much appreciated, but... um, Yeah, what can I say? <laughs> thank you. <laughs> mm. Yeah, just going c3. Oh, he attacks the rook. Gonna sidestep, of course. By the way, guys, if I like actually plan to stream more often, we gotta get in some alerts. I actually have alerts and that kind of stuff, but I'm a rusty streamer. I haven't used that in like ages, so. Yeah, somebody has to take care of that. Okay, let's just go full exchanging uh, mode on. Just like trade everything, take with the bishop, take with the rook. Okay, he's attacking my queen, so I'd better not hang that. That would be embarrassing, I guess. I'm gonna do a double attack. Is there any discounts uh, or anything on the London course? I don't think it's on a sale right now, but if you're like uh, waiting for a sale, uh, you could get like. Um, 
the video included for like mm -hmm. half of that. So uh, I would be waiting for a sale if I was you. Uh, for sure. There's going to be a sale at some point. But if not, I mean, what can you lose? I don't remember when is last time anyone like said my London system course was good, so. Are you taking on uh, coaching clients? I mean, you could like send me a message in private, but um, we'll have to like figure it out. <laughs> uh, okay. Picking up F4. That's actually made, so no need, not even need to like uh, pick up the bishop. And by the way, thank you for the dono even score. Appreciate that. No need for donations, guys, but uh, you know, these are like very much appreciated. Every donation that you send, it's like um, delaying uh, my debut on OnlyFans with like a few more days. So and that is very much appreciated. That's like really helping my survival. So, uh, okay, who are we playing next? Good game opponent. Let's do this guy. Oh, I'm getting the white pieces. So let's try to play something fun. Oh, see the Scandinavian. I guess I've got uh, the fun opening that I've asked for. Should I be playing my own recommendation? That would be kind of lame. I'm just going to play knight c3. Oh, he does that. Like the Portuguese, I guess. This is like literally one of the worst openings that you guys could play. I wouldn't uh, recommend. Gonna play like knight c3. Okay, e6, by the way, I feel like it's a bit better to start uh, knight f3, not to allow e5. I think e5 is an interesting move for him, but now I'm just like chilling. But it's just much better. C c5, um, yeah, well, I could just do bishop e2. I could also play d5. d5 should be pretty strong. I could do bishop e3 as well, I guess. Yeah, probably bishop e3. I'm not like really afraid of 9g4, I think. Are you full-time YouTuber chess player? Yes, I am. I mean, uh, I'm doing uh, content like... I'm like kind of focusing on content and courses and... Uh, yeah, I also have like um, daily lessons, so... I'm like only working um, around chess. I mean... As long as we can survive and we don't have to make that only fans that some of you, some of you want, <laughs> you weirdos, you're just going to go here. I can like actually go for the rook trap almost. Just going to do bishop d4 because I want to keep like... Um, Healthy pawn structure. I mean, the thing with the chessable course, you don't have to like actually remember all the lines. Uh, I mean, a course is like super comprehensive because that's like how courses are. You have you wanna have like the theory, which you can use uh, basically since you're like. Having no rating, and you can literally use that course to become an international master at least. So, uh, yeah, that is uh, that is like a lot of theory. But I mean, if you just focus on like a few lines from the Chigorin, um, and I mean, oh, I would really like recommend you just like watch the rating climb videos with the London, and that's gonna be like a pretty good indicator of like what you have to like really know. There's not like that many lines uh, you actually need to. F down. What's the best way to support you then? Oh, that is a very good question. I'm glad somebody finally asked that. So make sure to go ahead and vote me in the course of the year thing. Link is in the chat, just saying. Only if you have my London course. So if you don't have my London course, don't do that. 
that would be fraud. But uh, if you do by any chance and you like that, why not just vote? I mean, it's a win-win. I mean, you don't win anything, but uh, it's a win-win for me. Is there a challenge in queue? Yeah, there are like a lot of challenges. I mean, I mean, not that many, actually, only 12. What are you guys even doing? We've got like how many viewers? 150 viewers. Why is like only 12 challenges? Are you guys like afraid? Do you, is there any chance like you suck a chess? Why don't you challenge? What are you afraid of? I mean, you see that I'm... I'm not actually playing that well, so I wouldn't be afraid of like an old retired guy that hasn't played over the board chess in over like three years, so I don't know what's in your mind and you don't challenge. Can you go from uh, zero to 2000 in 10 months? Yes, I mean, if you cheat, you can do that in like <laughs> one day. <laughs> um, Okay, pick up this, just like picking up everything. Just a winning king and pawn end game. Need to not let his pawn queen, and we should be good. I'm 1600, you will chew me and uh, spit me out. I'm pretty sure uh, I won't do that. And... Uh, also, I wouldn't say that I would swallow because that would be taken out of context. So I'm not eating anybody, guys. I'm just like playing chess. Stop being weird. Okay. Can you just like stop being weird for a second? It's not that hard. May even get some friends one day. Challenge me in 1v1 at league. I mean, I'll be taking challenges if we do the league stream ever. Still, like, not confident enough in my League of Legends abilities, but maybe at some point, if we get, like, many, maybe other, like, chess guy play, could be maybe more interesting. Or chess girl, I don't mind, okay? I don't mind chess girls either. <laughs> How to become a GM in a year? Guys, what are these questions? Out of all the things that uh, you could have asked... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, ask the AI, guys. Have you, like, tried chat GPT? I mean, GPT, you know what I mean. Ask that, how do you become a GM in a year? You're probably going to get a better answer than I, I would say, so. <laughs> okay, guys, so if you want a challenge, I mean, just saying... We've got like any people that just tuned into the stream. I'm playing viewers. I'm playing like everyone. This is not like a recording. This is like happening right now, live in real time. Yes, it's not a video. So you can go ahead and challenge me by uh, using the link from the chat. Yes. But before you do that, make sure to vote me in the offer of the year thing. Okay. Enough of that. Uh, okay, we've got an Icelandic 300 rated player, so... Let's see what he's up to. He's going to play the D4 move and I'm going to like hit him with the angle and I'm going to be like merciless. And I have no mercy on my opponent. Let's see. <laughs> I like the job of London myself. It's just that... Uh... Yeah, I'm actually considering just one so we do like the rating climb uh... with E4. Uh... Once we're done with that. I'm thinking to just do, do a new climb with the with the Jubava. Just go like knight f6, develop, play a good old Slav. Try to play it even as a reversal. I'm gonna do that, okay? Oh, he plays the. <laughs> this guy just got the uh, Sam Shanklin's course. What's happening? He's playing the Neo Catalan. Oh my. Oh my, I'm scared. <laughs> Prove that uh, it's not a video. Take today's uh, newspaper. Wait, what? <laughs> okay, let's see. Mm. 
I'm just gonna go like uh, E697. Just the normal development, nothing crazy. I could take one C4, no need to do that. Oh, 95. I mean, that one is like a bit harder to ignore. I could like take and play like 97. Neo Cattle at a 300. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know. That's like... <laughs> Somebody's been starting his openings. <laughs> Yo, glad to help, Jakub. Go for H5 plan. No need to go crazy. And is that like the real uh, Nihil Dixit? That's like a... That's like a pretty decent chess player, isn't it? I think I saw him around the tournaments from India. Yo, thank you for that, Julian. Appreciate it. How to play against you? Just uh, use the link to my profile from the chat and uh, send in a challenge, like a 3 plus 0 preferably. And hope for the best. That's, that's, that's kind of it. Just send it and fingers crossed. It's just like, you know, you send a message in like a battle. Just like throw it into the water and then you like hope we get a game. <laughs> it's a bishop takes. Uh, thinking that just like play this solid. I mean, I could also just take the pawn. I mean, I don't see a clear way for him to recapture. <laughs> okay, my opponent actually says in the chat that he never got any courses. <laughs> Well, I mean, you never know. You defeated Dina, right? Yes, that is uh, one of the things I am mainly known for. I haven't really accomplished much besides beating Dina Belenkaya once. She like uh, really crushed me in the upcoming games, but got her in the first one. Got her for the video, so that's what matters. <laughs> you guys have no idea how badly I got him beaten up after. Uh, I mean, honestly, out of like maybe 15 games, she won like, I would say, 8 or 9, something like that. I played like way worse after. Takes, takes, hitting the rook. There's actually f6 idea, by the way, just uh, winning this guy. So yeah, queen g4. He tried, man. I mean, he have, he's having like the time of his life. He's having a, a flat of mate in one. So he's here, like one move away. But, well, I mean, how am I really going to stop this? Is there any way I can stop it? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Guys, what is going on? I want to go f6, but is like queen e6 a problem? I guess it's not, but it's not really something I want to allow. Wait, Michal, what do you mean you haven't seen the video when I played Dina? Dude, that video has like 5 million views. How can you like miss it? <laughs> Do I have a video about Vienna? I mean, I have videos. I've got courses. I mean, not many videos, but I do have just about courses in the Vienna and other stuff um, besides that. So I have like courses about like any E4 opening that you guys want. I mean, not really any opening, but I got like a full repertoire on E4, which is not easy to do. I mean, making E4 is uh, <laughs> in an E4, like a repertoire, it's kind of like a full time job. Yeah, bishop d6, uh, I can really do whatever, but I guess just uh, take and pick up the free rook. Bishop d5, yeah. Get rid of the queen, pick up the bishop next. Oh, he tried. I mean, that was a good tactic that he tried. Too bad, uh, too bad he's losing, you know. <laughs> Yo, glad to help smoking toast in. Appreciate that. <laughs> to be honest, 
This guy played a little bit better than 300 in Blitz. If somebody is like 300 in Blitz, you expect him to play way worse. This guy like actually tried something. He, he, he's he been like threatening mate in one, which like 300s never do. So I think this guy played quite well for his rating. I would give him at least like a 500. How do we challenge you? Can you use the link um, from the chat right now? Boom, link is there. Wait, why is the opponent not resigning? I'm gonna like report him for stalling. <laughs> oh, never mind. Never mind. He's there. He's there. He's there. He's there. He's back. Yo, Jude, welcome to the stream. How are you? Nice to have you here. I still have you guys, all of you. <laughs> uh, okay, let's go for next. Uh, all right, so what's like the highest rated challenge? Okay. I think we're gonna stick with like the highest rated challenge for now. <laughs> Let's see. Yo, Isa, welcome to the stream. Oh, by the way, we've got like actually a pretty interesting question going. What is the difference between 500 to 1000 and uh, 1500? So, I mean, between like 500 and 1000 is that obviously the 500 is just like hang all of their pieces. At 1000, you don't really hang that much, you still hang, but. Not that often. And at 1500, you rarely hang something randomly, I would say. That'd be my understanding of it. But I mean, what do I know? Why are you even watching this stream? So, I don't know, guys. <laughs> what are you doing with your life right now? You did threaten mate. That was actually very unexpected. You did great. Bath, that was good. This castle, the tree, play like a Vienna kind of thing. Hey, thank you for that, uh, Christian. Appreciate that. Glad to help, especially the newer players. Fuck the experienced players. We don't care about them, we care about the newer players. If you're still in the chat, uh, Duku, that was meant for you, so. <laughs> we had the uh, newest uh, Romanian Grandmaster in the chat like a while ago. Probably he left because why would he still be here? Of course, that's like not really where you should be spending your time as a Grandmaster, but <laughs> it was nice to have him for a second. Maybe we're going to get him for a league game. I don't know. He's like... He's actually similar to my level in league, so at least something that I can compete uh, with him at. <laughs> I mean, compete is a bit too much since we both suck, but you get it. Okay, so technically speaking, this would be the pawn break that we want to go for. Now, I could sort of cheat and go for like a brutal sacrifice. The thing is, the main reason why I'm allowed to do this, he never has like ideas to break and he's never like in time to do anything in the center really, so I could really do whatever and be okay. I think we just do the rook lift thingy. I'm, I'm, I don't mind like 94, just play around it. Oh, so he goes for the knight there. Here, he wants like knight f4. Can I like really take it? I guess I can and then play bishop d5, just scoop the pawn. That's like really simple. Can I play the car against you? If you get paired, of course, you can play whatever. <laughs> just uh, send in a challenge. getting rid of this and now this is pretty annoying so that's why uh 
we make sure to get rid of the knight and then the plan is to bring the queen over something like that pick up the pawn so i could do queen g4 probably queen f3 is just a bit better because on queen g5 there is rook move just wanna collect this this has to go pick up the pawn. He still has a bit of comp, like there's a check, but queen f2 at least should have it under control. Dude, I feel like my chat is full of pussies. Nobody's challenging, only 20 challenges. I mean, we've got like almost 200 viewers, so... What is that, like 10%? What is this? You can play an IM for free and you're not doing it? Dude, what is wrong with people in my chat? What are you even doing? Guys. <laughs> Big mistake. Okay, A6. Hmm. I could just like think of pushing, but this is kind of the position where we want to slow down and uh, convert. But what I'm going to do anything but that. Uh, I would recommend you the Karo Khan, just, uh, um, choke him. <laughs> well, what a name. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> uh, I would recommend you the Karo, yeah, if you're, like, talking about E4. Why not? Why not go for the Karo? I'm down to play, uh, Dixit anytime. Is he, like, challenging? Dixit is, like... He was a feeder master last time I saw him. Not sure what he's at. Maybe he's a GM because, like, everybody becomes a GM in the meantime. Only myself and Gotham Chess cannot make it to GM, so. Chances are he's already a GM, but we'll see if he challenges. Yeah, it's pretty funny. My rook is... <laughs> what is... Dude, <laughs> how do you, like, end up having such rook? Oh, my God. Dude, how did I, like, call my rook on that square? Guys, do you, like, actually see what's happening? He's like, oh, I've got three seconds. I've got three seconds. Gotta speed up. Gotta speed up. Oh, no. Gotta actually speed up. Oh, he attacked my knight. Shit. Dude. All right, this was not rated anyways. Oh, Dixit is still an FM. Okay, let's go. We, we, uh, we, I believe we have a chance of taking down Dixit if he challenges. Probably not, but let's see. Just make sure to challenge if you have uh, the link from the chat. <laughs> and by the way, guys, you should be challenging too. I'm going to play Dixie next, but then I'm just playing uh, random people anyways. I saw a comment saying that we should be playing uh, harder games, so we'll try Dixit if he's, like, around. But, uh, and we'll go back to playing against uh, anybody, like, randomly, so. Appreciate that, uh, Red Beard. I mean... That's nice of you for not going for the flag. Appreciate that. But I mean, this position was kind of winning. <laughs> I have to say, this position was still winning with like uh, F6 and all that. Mm -hmm. Bro, wh what is taking Dixit so long to challenge? He's like a title player. You got like no excuse. They have like no internet in India. What is going on? Yeah, but I see no challenge. Oh, I, I can maybe see better here. Huh. Uh, maybe it helps if you like add me at like your friends list. I'm just like kind of struggling to see this. I'm pretty sure your challenge won't pop out.
Do we have like any friendly quests or stuff like that? Of course not. Uh, yeah, I don't know, guys. Sorry, I'm just having a bit of a bit of a problem uh, finding this challenge. So I, I'm like unable to see challenge from Dixit, as you can. Uh, As you can see, but uh, yeah, I, I guess, yeah, that's just unlucky. Wait a second. It's simply that the challenge won't appear on my screen. I think I'm not blind. You guys like can see my screen. I'm like pretty sure on that. Yeah, anyways. I'll do Dixit whenever I see his challenge popping here, but uh, let's actually do it. So somebody's rated like 2,000. Somebody's actually rated 2,000, so uh, we'll do this person, and then we'll uh, play again. Um, just like random. Uh, yeah, in like random order. Do 10 minutes rapids? I mean, that's too slow. I mean, the point is, like, to try to play as many people as we can, so... No, um... Uh, no rapid today, at least. Guys. Just, uh, blitz. Hey, thank you for that, uh, Kunal. Appreciate the kind words. That's very nice of you to say. Yeah, no worries, uh... No worries, Dixit. Well, uh... We'll do a match at some point, no worries. I mean, you should get prepared, but just saying. How to join? Too much already? No, you can join. I'm like picking them in random order, so you could just come like uh, tune in one minute to the stream and you could be lucky enough to get picked, so. Just challenge and uh, wait. <laughs> and also, if you're just like uh, tuning in and by any chance you're familiar with my London system course, you could be voting me for the offer of the year by using the link from the chat right now and from like the pinned comment. That is, you want to help me out, that's like the best uh, thing you can do. So that's very much appreciated. Pawn cube, no pawn cube here, unfortunately, but this guy's like playing kind of like a tricky King's Indian. I don't like it. I don't like it not a single bit, but it is what it is. I guess bishop goes here, bishop to h6, we castle short, we just like chill down. No more long castle when he plays this sort of tricky way. Oh, I see Dixie challenging in- Dude, I'm not playing 10 minutes, what is that? Who plays 10 minutes online? That's like... That's not a thing. He just h3, useful move. Then we maneuver the knight. <laughs> e5. Usually we take... Knight c5 is a little bit annoying. I guess it's just gonna be fine for my opponent. Yeah, I, I'm like a bit slow with this. Probably exchange, go like queen e3, try to stop knight c5. I'm not sure I'm doing this the right way by any means. Ideally, we wanna like maneuver this to g3, castle short, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna be in time. I play this a bit strange. Hmm. Bishop b7, I mean just castle, bishop b6, probably we decline, knight there, mm, I think I'm not care about f5, just take, we're happy to see that, knight e2, stopping knight f4, and uh, can we go g4, knight f4, take, go like queen d4, check, that's maybe interesting. 
Yo, welcome to the stream, Aaron. How is it going? <laughs> Glad to help. Yeah, we, we should be going for some Kingside Storm if you like play this properly, not like I do. But that's my favorite uh, chess player at the moment. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I mean, I should be going ahead and say, like Magnus said, uh, my version from, from like three years ago or something. Well, it's not that clearly, but uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't really have like a favorite player. Uh huh. Wait a second. I'm I'm like considering whether to go queen g five, whether to do like anything else. I mean, maybe just hope for that. I don't know. Checkers take more skill. I actually have no idea about that, but maybe. Kind of doubt it though. Hey, thank you for that no life one. Appreciate it. Nodirberg is the goat. I mean, Nodirberg is cool. I mean, don't get me wrong. He's just a bit too positional for me. Uh, that's all. Wait, isn't this just a mate if he takes? I mean, I have to hope he takes. Probably if he doesn't, that's just like a bad move. <laughs> Yeah, of course you won't take. I mean, I would he? All right, we actually gotta like do a lot of work to win this game, which is probably not even gonna happen. But uh, we have to try, I guess. Uh, yeah, gonna do this ugly move, even though it's not great. I don't know what to play. Maybe g5, just push. Knight h6, I want to take that. Okay, I felt this should be dangerous for him, but maybe it's not. There's like f4 as a move. Also, there's knight h5 as a move, but h6. Kind of iffy. Not the best game. How do we play you? You can just use the link to my profile and um, then the challenge. And then, yeah, challenge in like three minutes and just hope you get picked. That's what it is. Yo, we've got Navi. In the stream, how are you doing, Mr. Naveen? That's very unexpected visit, but we'll take it. <laughs> Turned in at the right moment when, like, this 2000 is schooling me. Damn it. Um, okay, what can we do try to win this game? Probably not. Not a lot. He even took the right way. I was hoping he takes with the apron, but that was clearly a mistake, so he didn't, of course. Oh, this is embarrassing. This is a bad game. Try to bring my king. I mean, maybe hope for something weird with his pawns. Oh, that kind of blunders. Don't do that. Anything is a blunder at this point, though. Black looks like a pro player. Yeah, I don't know what kind of pro player he is, but uh, he's definitely a little bit better than I am, which is enough. <laughs> Usually it's enough. You don't need to like play. Brilliant, just be a little bit better than your opponent, so. 
for sure he accomplished that uh, in this game at least. But I mean, like, what the fuck? Why is this guy like playing so well? He, he lost like C. He's been like losing the whole day every single time, but against me now he's playing like some kind of a genius. Jeez. <laughs> It's like my life in uh, my life in a nutshell. Everybody losing the whole day. They get paired against me. It's their lucky streak. Okay, at least we're gonna mate him. At least somebody's gonna get mated. Never mind. I will just uh, I will just lose instead. Forget about the mating part. Uh, oh, there's no time on my clock. That's a problem. That will be a problem. Oh, let's try to get night. Dude, where is my back rancor? They told me I was supposed to have a back rancor. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Just in time. Just in time, all right. Never in doubt. Hey, thank you for that uh, hero.x, appreciate it. <laughs> right, who are we playing? Okay, let, let, let's take the Dixit. Jesus, Dixit, who plays like five minutes chess? Who play? I don't know who plays five minutes chess online, but I mean, I'm, I'm going to take your challenge, I guess, in five minutes. Okay, he does this. Let's see if he has the refutation of my upcoming car concourse. If I lose this game, I'll have to contact Chessable and withdraw the, the agreement. We'll have to, like, sign up something else, like a French defense or, or something. I don't know. The beats battery died. It could be. It could be, but I mean, you never know. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Wait. I mean, I could be taking both ways. Don't really remember, but I guess this is fine. Ninety six E6, just like uh Get developed. Usually I get worse positions than this in the um in this opening, so so far it's been uh quite okay. I mean probably we'll go downhill in like five moves, but you'll have to enjoy enjoy it as uh, as you have it, you know. Pizza or burgers? Dude, what is that question? Of course, none. You should be eating way healthier, guys. That is uh, definitely something that you should be doing. Am I doing that? Not necessarily right now, but was I doing that? Of course. Of course. Why would you eat that? Eat some better food. I don't know what better food, but... Eat egg whites. You can recommend that. <laughs> <laughs> I'd prefer egg whites any day of the week. I got a funny idea. Probably doesn't work. Probably not very good. The night before A3. <laughs> Let's do it anyways, just because it's funny. I'm probably going to lose, but who cares? Oh. Let's go there. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> What's the night doing over there? I don't know. It's just a night chilling. <laughs> Could have probably played C4, but I don't know if that was good. Favorite food? Guys, there's no such thing as favorite food. Just, uh... I'm, like, thankful that there is food. <laughs> that is, like, how you approach the situation. Best opening for white? I mean, that's clearly the London system. If you want to quit chess. Am I just winning a pawn? 
Wait. Wait a minute. I feel like we could be winning a point, but I feel like it's too good to be true. I feel like this is a little bit too nice to actually happen. We might be winning a pawn. I need to come out to LA. Dude, I've got like many people in LA. Have some proper meals. Yeah, I'll probably eat nothing uh, the whole visit. <laughs> I get that. That's fine. <laughs> Just defend, I guess. I mean, probably I'm gonna blunder this very soon, so. The position looks good for now, guys, but don't really expect me to win, I mean. Should always like uh lower your expectations while you're watching the stream, so you already know that I guess. Okay, F5, do this. I mean, it's not deep, like just thankful that there is food. It's <laughs> it's like survival mode. I mean that's how uh that's how Romania works. <laughs> it's not like something that I necessarily get to choose. Yo, thank you for that, uh, Mr. O. Appreciate it. <laughs> it looks like we're picking up another opponent. Mr. Dixit got his rook trapped. That is ridiculous. Maybe I shouldn't have said that because now he's going to... He's gonna move it. Wait, there is rook b3? What am I missing? What do you guys think I am missing? I mean... Yeah, I don't know. It just feels like we should be able to win this game, but how? There seems to just be no win. What is my win? This is becoming annoying because I really need to have my win now. Hmm. Yeah, don't see the win. Too bad. I'm gonna just activate. Opinions on Andrew Tate? I don't know, man. What are your guys' opinion? You let me know in the chat. <laughs> hey, thank you for that, Alex. Appreciate it. <laughs> Can you just pick up all the pawns? That can't be too bad either. Okay, got four extra pawns. What could go wrong? Oh, he wants knight f4. Let's not do that. Maybe just this. To begin with. Um, okay. What next? Guess we just gotta push him, baby. Okay, let's do the king. Just hope I don't get forked. Alexander Tate. <laughs> Dude, you're supposed to be helping me. <laughs> uh, okay. Hoping for the last uh, trick. <laughs> Good game, dear. Um I mean... I feel like you should have tried C4 against my goofy knight move. 
my, my, my name was like so nonsense. You see, for anything, he's much better. That was like really uncalled for. But, but the position is just like a draw now. But but it was like very kind to let me beat him in stream. So you guys think I, I, I can actually play a good game of chess, which is not necessarily true, but we very much appreciate uh, support by uh, Mr. Dixit. So you check him out. He probably doesn't stream, but <laughs> you do that. Okay, who's next? Uh, all right, I feel like like we're gonna take somebody from the. Okay, we took UK. Okay, let's go Saudi Arabia. Let's do that. D four. Oh my God, I know what he's trying to do. Gotta do this. Gotta do this. Okay. Hey, thank you for that, Angel. Appreciate it. Knight f3. Yeah, so I think the interesting way to play the England is d6, but uh, of course, I'm going to do it like all the passers do. But I think d6 is actually not bad for the England. How many lines will your car course have? It's... Uh, it's supposed to have like a hundred trainables, so it's gonna be based more on like clickables. But we will have like the middle game chapters and this kind of stuff that we do have in the like uh, London course. So it's gonna be like, let's say lighter when it comes to the Fury, but we'll make sure to have more of like this kind of middle games themes and model games and stuff like that. So um, I believe it's gonna be better than the London course, but what do I know? J just speaking of, if there's like any viewers, any new viewers in the stream that haven't uh, heard about this, if you have my London course, you can actually go ahead and uh, vote uh, me as the course of the year on Chessable uh, by using the link from the chat right now. I mean, honestly, you can probably vote anyways. You just need to have a Chessable account. Um, and yeah. You do that. Link is in the chat and in the pinned comment. That would be in the word to me, you know, guys. That would be like really something. Just imagine getting course of the year. Just imagine that. How cool is that? It's like, I don't know what level of coolness to compare it with. Good game, Nike Air. <laughs> Thank you for that. Guys, my name is not important. You can pronounce it whatever. That's like uh, less relevant. You can just call me dude. Watched a couple of your YouTube videos. Does that count? I mean, you try to use the link and you let me know. Just try to make it interesting. Levy will get it probably. <laughs> Levy has no courses on the platform yet, so it's like for the previous year, not for like the upcoming one. But maybe he's gonna get it anyways without having the course. That would be like goated. Get course of the year without actually having a course on Chessable. That would be like if you're like really a good offer. That's how you do it. <laughs> <laughs> you don't even like need to have an actual course there uh, they give it to you like anyways because they know you would have won <laughs> opinion on Dutch defense dude why do you like to lose you want to lose or what Splitting him to take, gonna take with a queen or else g4 is pretty annoying. Hey, thank you for that, uh, Elias. Appreciate it. When did you become an IM? I became an IM when I uh, started uh, thinking more seriously about uh, my life and reflect. So, you guys should do the same. You never know what happens. Maybe even become a GM. Most likely not. 
But why would you want to be a GM in the first place, though? That would be weird. Opinions and opinions? Opinions are overrated. He's probably gonna take that pawn. I mean, I just like sacked it to get some open files. Yo, welcome to the stream, uh, Hussein. Hey, glad to help. Uh, casually bad. Appreciate that. Appreciate the kind words. Hey, what do I do? Just double up? That's kind of boring. But I guess uh, it fits the personality of the stream, so. Okay, just do this. Maybe queen h5. Opinion on Scandi? Scandi's pretty bad. Oh, we just played King G2. I wasn't looking, sorry. Of course, take the queens. Why wouldn't you when you're uh, down a piece? Everybody does that. Uh, okay, d5. Just like improve the knight, just uh, collect the win pretty soon. What about the Danish? Guys, oh, what makes you like uh, weird openings? <laughs> okay. And a little surprise for my opponent. Pick this up. Probably I missed mate in one or, I mean, not mate, but close. Dude, openings are super important, like, no matter what your level is. What do you mean people should stop caring about the opening? Sure, if you want to lose, you shouldn't care about your opening. Why would you? I mean, guys, why on earth would you care about, like, the first 10 to 15 moves in your games? Like, clearly there's not any way that um you could, like, win from the opening or you could be aware of ways that your opponent could beat you in the opening or... They just say you could have a comfortable, you know, time playing chess. Why would you like bother learning opening when you just know for sure, whenever you sit down at the table to play, dude, you're sure you're going to have an opening. Middle game, end game, you don't know about that. Dude, it's like you're preparing for like having a girlfriend, which will never happen. That's just pointless. So, of course, study openings. Uh, these people just make me go mad. Why wouldn't you study openings? This is crazy. No, I'm not Polish. <laughs> First opening I learned was Larson opening. <laughs> My God, guys, you and your weird openings that like really drive me nuts. <laughs> Let's play some E4. Got the Karo Khan. Let's play aggressive. Keep my promise. Dania said ignoring openings is the number one beginner mistake. It is. I mean, I'm not sure if it's like a number one beginner mistake, but it's clearly a mistake. As an Indian, I can verify the girlfriend example. It's true. What do you mean? <laughs> that was not like directed against any Indians, so you don't have to take it that way. It was directed to like all chat, not uh, any country specifically. 
97, I mean, just castle, play c4 as well. I think both are fine. Well, I'm glad to have you here too, Martin. So glad you're enjoying the Vienna and Caro. Just gonna take. ED, just castle. Are you sure you're not Spanish? <laughs> I've been to Spain like a couple of times, but don't think uh, I can call myself Spanish for that. I did play some Rui Lopez though in my life. Maybe that should count for something. It was not like the most successful thing ever, but I don't know, maybe. Yeah, C4, probably I should have just played. Simple queen c2 move. I don't know why I'm being like over aggressive here. Queen f5 is kind of like uncalled for, but uh, I guess we just got rewarded for it now that he blunders f7. My aim is to sleep uh, before 4 a.m. It's 3.35 now. Dude, like, what's the point of sleeping anyways if you've got, if you, like, watch any kind of successful person talk, like, the f number one rule is that you just gotta, like, uh, keep sleeping. You've got, like, extra nine hours to work. You work, like, 20 hours a day. Just have to not sleep and you can become a billionaire. We have to just keep sleeping and hope to not die in, like, two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> Um, okay, just uh, I can pick up this pawn with check to pick up uh, g5 next. Guys, there's nothing special you need to do to play me, just uh, use the link from the chat and uh, yeah, send a challenge. Hope you get picked. Uh, I'm actually not super sure for how long I'm gonna like uh, keep the stream now but uh, I mean you have a chance so if you just turned in I'm like picking random players to ch that challenge me so you may very well just get picked it doesn't matter that you wait or not uh, it's always like random so probably I'm gonna be streaming for maybe more than like an hour more and that's gonna be it but in case we've got uh, any new people in the in the stream, make sure to vote me for the offer of the year. If you want to like support the the channel in like any way, that would be really appreciated. So you can use the link from the chat for that. In case you have like a chessable account, if if you don't, I mean don't bother. So. <laughs> I, I'm in Romania right now. I don't live in America. If that's like safe to say, maybe I shouldn't be revealing my location. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> oh, that was like a free night. Oops. Got a nice little checkmate. <laughs> Any recommendation against the Sicilian? The only thing I know is the Marochi. Well, the thing is, you cannot really play the Marochi successfully against everything. It just works against like the accelerated dragon or stuff like that. So it depends. I mean, I have courses for white on E4, so those are my recommendation. Yeah, I've got an American flag. Yeah, I mean, that's that's true. I mean, that's to confuse you guys. Seems to be working. <laughs> Seems to be working well so far. 
Uh, all right, let's do Joker. Not sure who that is, but he just got lucky and he's about to get Jobava London. Oh, never mind. We do this, go for end game, no problem. I see your lessons. Wait, what do you mean? If you just like use the this link, I mean you just have to like complete a survey on like a bunch of things. So I don't know what lesson you refer to. Challenge me in three minutes, guys. If you do, that's like what I'm picking. A video about your life uh, and journey would be great. I feel like the journey is just like uh, beginning, so... I'm not sure that would be like a great timing for that type of video. <laughs> yeah, E6 is actually, you could do that. It's it's interesting to play. I, I was just not like super familiar when they don't trade queens. I'm going to be honest. <laughs> That's an interesting sideline to go. Bishop D3, H5 and mate. Start a vlog channel? What should I be vlogging about? Like, oh, here's my computer. I stay 10 hours here and then I go to sleep and I repeat. <laughs> Just vlog that? I don't know. <laughs> Would you guys watch that vlog? My life is not like interesting enough, guys, to make such vlogs. But um, yeah, if somehow it becomes very interesting overnight, I'll let you know. You'll be the first one to know, okay? <laughs> mm. Yo, yeah, appreciate that, Craig. Glad, glad to help. Vlogging with the bug? I mean, we could maybe make a show, like not a vlog, but like a survival mode kind of channel. You know, like the Bear Grylls type of stuff, like trying to survive in the wild. I can do survive in Romania with minimum wage. <laughs> that could be interesting. Okay, you want to do this and uh, mate on age one? What do you do to bring cash uh, besides chess, uh, Mr. Alex? I, I do nothing besides chess, guys. I mean, why would you be like dumb enough to even bring cash in these times? I mean, inflation is going to be like messing you up anyways. Like, get, who's going to be happier at the end of the day? Me, that inflation won't affect because I don't have like any money to burn. Or you that struggle, made like so many millions of dollars and you just think about like how many hundreds and thousands of dollars that you're losing just because inflation is eating your life. I mean, who's sleeping better at the end of the day? Why would you do something else besides just in the first place? I don't get it. That's a dumb question. Why am I like even answering that? <laughs> Oh, yeah, just uh, vote my course, guys. I meant to, like, vote for the course. I mean, I'm not listed for the offer, but you get it. Like, you see my, uh, you see my name there. Just uh, vote that. That's, like, appreciated. Okay, let's take, uh, see, this guy, 1,700. Probably going to hunt me down. Let's see. <laughs> And I go like e4. 
How many people are in the queue? That's less re less relevant because it's not like really a queue. I'm playing anybody random, so it's just like kind of like a lottery, except <laughs> the price is not that exciting. So, <laughs> what your lord and course? Thanks for that. Appreciate it. I'm 22, guys. Yeah, I'm, I'm an I am. I mean, there is a title like next to my name at the bottom. That is usually the sign that you are an I am. So yes, I am an I am. You guys figure that out. You're like pretty, <laughs> pretty good at finding uh, obvious things. Okay, I'll stop trash talking you. Fine, fine. Okay. Do I want to cast a long? I will cast a short in these things. E5 is just much better anyway. What is this guy even trying to do? This opening is so trash. Why is he playing it that way? I don't get it. His opening is so bad. That's just like kind of driving me nuts. You should do a video with Levy and Rosen and get their subs. Yes, I'm gonna like specifically reach out to Levy and I'm gonna tell him, dude, let's make a video so I can steal your subs. I'm gonna do that after we finish the stream. What do you guys think will be the reply? <laughs> Okay, playing bishop b5. Hmm. I mean, endgame is not too bad, I guess. Can you become a master without coach books and stuff? Probably, yes. Uh, there's cases, but uh, young players usually get that for free, so why wouldn't you? It's tough, though. I mean, there's like very few people who do that, and most people who say they just taught themselves. I mean, they usually had like 10 different high-level coaches, and they just want to look smart. I can tell you there's like plenty of such cases. They're just like, oh, I got, I discovered the chessboard and I studied myself and I like played and analyzed, but in reality, you know, they just like have very rich parents and they just have like five different coaches and it's usually how it goes. And they're like, oh, I taught myself and I'm a genius. <laughs> Still, I mean, I think money uh, has like no guarantee that he could be a good chess player, but uh, it definitely helps to be coached by uh, some of the best uh, in the world, you know, <laughs> that can hurt. I mean, Of course, I had many coaches, guys. I mean, I've been coached by the best Romanian player. So I've been like uh, the luckiest from that perspective. So always thankful for that. Maybe if the channel grows at some point, uh, we're going to have uh, enough viewers that uh, I'm not going to be embarrassed to ask him to join the stream. So <laughs> that's a goal. I've been super lucky. I mean, I haven't had like a lot of coaches to reach Fide Master, but after that, um, I had the best coach. Uh, guys, you can just uh, look at my chess.com profile if you want to send over a challenge. Now h4 is kind of annoying for him to deal with because he's losing a piece in case he takes. By the way, I've got like no time on the clock. Probably should be a winning endgame since g5 is dropping and I still have a pawn there and that's like clearly winning. Yeah, no question about this endgame. 
just gonna go after he spawns. <laughs> I guess just need to not stalemate. I haven't second my queen, I just traded. Mm. I mean, when I was getting coaching, Bogdan deck was... Uh, was 2,500. <laughs> I actually even... Uh, even played him a few times. But I'm talking about Konstantin Lupulescu, guys. He was the best Romanian player for a while, rated... 2650 Oh, why am I playing like uh what is this? I feel like I'm just uh, I just started playing against random people for no reason. Sorry guys, I'm supposed to like play against viewers. I'm not sure if this guy like challenged, but I might have just kind of Lost focus there for a second and click the random button. Okay, let's do this guy. He's got a Hikaru Nakamura picture. For sure he's a... He's an interesting person. Can you beat Hikaru? I mean, probably I can beat Hikaru out of like a lot of games, but... Uh, I'm of course gonna get busted uh, pretty badly. Yeah, I was playing a random game. I realized that. I just like, I don't know, guys. It's... Uh, I guess I got tired. <laughs> uh, oh, he's he's doing like this sort of weird stuff. Uh, how do we even play against this? Let's just do... Let's do C5. I mean, that's double-edged. I'm not playing OTB, by the way. I saw a question, but no, I haven't played in like... Um... Uh, mm. Three years almost. They just literally quit after I secured my last IM norm. Plays knight c3. Let's take b2. Short term black, you can challenge. Just let me know your username. <laughs> I see you're also a YouTuber, so we could do like a YouTuber match. Who's the better YouTuber? <laughs> <laughs> see guys, this guy is a YouTuber. I can try to actually steal his subscribers. Now that you had this brilliant idea in the chat. <laughs> <laughs> You only play the Karo when white goes e4? I mean, I can play many things, guys, but uh, for the videos, I mainly recommend the Karo and for lower rated players. Just drops the bishop. Pick up this. Okay, let's get castled. Now oh, for queen trade, I mean, I just want like so many pieces so quickly that uh, this game is not really interesting. Uh, Yo, thanks for that, Peter. That's very nice of you. Appreciate that. Glad to help. Thanks for that, uh, Eric Lamar. Appreciate it.
You think he can become a grandmaster in the future? I mean, hard to say. Probably with like the current regulations, not. But um, yeah, if... the main reason why I'm not like actually interested at all to become a GM is just because it takes way too much time, in my opinion, to like travel and play a tournament is just like kind of ridiculous. And yeah, I think you could like find a system where you can like sort of apply the same uh, metrics and become a GM by playing rapid chess. Because I don't believe someone can play a uh, GM level in rapid and <laughs> then play like what? We could in classical, what's that? That doesn't make sense. So probably with the current regulations, I wouldn't be able to reach GM because I wouldn't like pursue such thing. I mean, only if we would be making videos out of it or stuff like that. So just like kind of farming it for content, maybe I would risk to lose my mental sanity for that, uh, which I'm not so sure that's there in the first place. <laughs> so, uh, okay, let me actually try to challenge, uh, challenge this guy. Not sure if we could do that, but... Um, uh, wait, so play against, uh, okay, I think I sent in a challenge. Let's see. Okay, waiting. Let's see if Trend Black is still here. Thank you for that, Miguel. Appreciate it. Do you do one on one lessons? I do one on one lessons. Uh, you could like uh, DM me on, uh, on Leeches and I'll get back to you as fast as I can. How long do you think you can get GM? Again, guys, with like the way the system works right now, I wouldn't pursue GM. But um, if it was like a rapid kind of event thing, I think I could be reaching like, let's say, GM level if I focus mainly on playing chess and like training for a year. But I mean... That means not doing a lot of other things that I love to do, so. Yeah, I don't know. Tricky to say. Is just popular in Romania? I mean, not really. We don't really have like a big just culture or anything. I mean, we did get like a lot of sponsors recently in uh, Romanian chess, but still waiting to see the results. I feel like chess is just becoming worse and worse, just like every sport in Romania. Which is sad, but how it goes. It takes so much effort financially and mentally to become GN unless you're like sponsored or something, right? Yeah, I mean, it depends, like, what do you have in mind with sponsored? Like, the best kind of sponsorship that you could have is, like, your expenses covered, so. <laughs> Which is still, like, quite a lot of money, but you'll have to uh, not be making money for a year as an adult, which, yeah, I mean, it's, um... It's a big thing when you're young, you know? You don't want to be wasting this year as, like, playing chess, right? <laughs> Maybe when you're old, you could pursue that. Why not? Hey, thank you for that, Abdul. Appreciate it. Gonna pick up the free night.
My opponent kind of blundered everything from move one, which is a bit unfortunate, but we'll give him a rematch if he's down. We gotta like see like his true potential with the white pieces. I mean, football fan is a bit too much to say, like, uh, I used to watch a lot of football, but I don't watch any games now. Um, I like football. I mean, probably I would like playing a bit more than, uh, than watching. Glad to help, uh, <laughs> Robert Kelly. Appreciate the kind words. What is GM level play? I mean, GM level play has uh, a lot to do with uh, calculation mainly. I'm like being very in shape. <laughs> with uh like calculating and this kind of stuff because like a lot of part of like the chess training it's really like this you gotta do this kind of puzzles which if you compare it to like other sports is like you have to do cardio which is like nothing special it's just kind of like a boring grind so if you like want to be serious chess player you still have to do that grind endlessly it's like going to the gym I mean Sure, I'm like an IM and I still calculate kind of decent just because I still work with chess and uh, I like work a lot with engine and engines that keeps me kind of in shape. But I swear if I like didn't do anything chess related for a year, I would calculate way worse. Still, I would be probably fit the master level, but um, it's like something hard to imagine actually. But you really have to calculate constantly in order to be decent. <laughs> a GM is just an IM who eats more burgers. <laughs> Finally, a man of culture in the chat. <laughs> Finally, somebody said something clever for the first time. Guys, I don't care about like your ratings when I'm taking challenges. It's just that I have 20 challenges open and I pick randomly. Yes, guys, I play a little bit of League of Legends, which is probably what I'm going to do after we close this stream soon. So <laughs> I've got important things to do with my life, okay? I'm going to be streaming probably for another half an hour. And then we're going to be on the grind. Okay, let's play the Austrian guy. Let's do a Jabava. He does this, which I'm actually not uh, very well prepared against, but I know for a fact this is interesting and that's where the theory ends. <laughs> My impersonation on Levy with the Rook was funny. Promise to stop doing that. Sorry guys, you had to see that. What do you think of Magnus? What is this question? He's like, smash or pass with Magnus? I don't get it. What can I potentially think about Magnus? What, what kind of answer do you expect? I don't get it. <laughs> okay, now I don't even, but do we actually check or just bishop g5? Guys, I'm like really a pleb in League of Legends. I picked at like gold four. And I just play jungle with uh, Ramus and Amumu, so. <laughs> you definitely don't want to see that, I'm telling you. <laughs> uh, he still F3 is a move. I could do Queen D2. Not sure I want to take. Probably just cast along.
What do I think of Paul Morphy? I mean, his games are fun, but his opponents were pretty bad. So. <laughs> I like his games, though. But it's hard to do plays like that against uh, decent opponents. Guys, I can play 24 hours straight. I can play games. I mean, the problem is not about playing them. The problem is about, like, being decent, which... Sometimes it's a struggle, even if uh, I'm, like, full focus mode, as you can see. So, yeah, I mean, I, I can play chess for, like, a lot of time. Like, when we used to have double round tournaments, there were days you could play, uh, like, let's say, five hours in the morning and five hours in the evening. And not to mention, like, the drinking routine that happens one night prior to that. Chess is a struggle sometimes. So yeah, I'm kind of used to playing just a lot of time. Just to answer that question. Uh, do I like actually want to take? I feel like if I don't, I'm going to lose a lot of time. Yeah, I think just keep it simple. I feel like he's underdeveloped. Have you beaten a GM? I've beaten many GMs, I mean. It's impossible to be an IM without beating a bunch of GMs. I actually had to win uh, with black against the GM to make my last IM norm. A draw was not enough, and I did it. I mean, nobody really believed in me. My dad's reaction when he, like, heard about, like, the pairing against the GM. By the way, just for a little bit of context, the GM probably had, like, the worst uh, tournament of his his life. His name is Stanek Nikolaus. He's, like, I think he picked at, like, 2600 at some point, but he was, like, 2550, and he was losing, like, 40 rating points that tournament. And the guy, like, cannot win a single game the whole tournament, and my dad's reaction when... He, like, finds out I have to win against him. He's like, okay, how do we pay this guy? We need to do something so you can win. Against a guy that didn't win, like, a single game in the whole tournament. So, <laughs> just so you guys have a little bit of context of... Yeah, you should be... Trusting yourself. Uh, otherwise, <laughs> others might not. Uh, okay, rook d6. There's just like 94. Looks interesting. I don't bother with anything. There's like queen 8 obviously too. Just gonna play king b1, make sure this is safe. Give a check. I mean, I assume this is winning. I'm just like not focused though, so I'm just gonna play whatever and probably lose. Gave him f2 for no reason. Ah, oh, he didn't take. He's a kind guy. Now he just lost. Oh, you're not supposed to see this. Okay. Queen there, threatening mate, but who's mating who? Alright, managed to get the game. <laughs> C-Squared Podcast is a good channel, guys. If you haven't checked it out, big shout out to C-Squared Podcast. We don't have a link for that, but big shout out. You probably already know them, so they're pretty cool guys. Am I in top 25 best active Romanian players? Dude, I'm not an active player. I haven't played a, a game in like years. Don't you see like how rusty I am? <laughs> Good game, Andreas. <laughs> I 
Uh, okay, guys, so uh, did I miss any important questions? Probably not. Just what do I think about Magnus? Very important question. <laughs> Why there are no women in top 100 players? Come on, guys, are you? Do you want me to say that uh, men are better than women in chess? Is that... Uh, what you're trying to bait me for? <laughs> Do you wanna get me in trouble? <laughs> I love my viewers. They just wanna like destroy me every single second that I'm live. But that's okay. <laughs> hey Jonathan, how are you, buddy? Nice to have you here. How's the Jabava going? Did you get any games? I gotta check. I've been a bit busy earlier in the day, but I'll, I'll have to check after the stream. Okay, just playing a Tardak over? <laughs> Clipped, of course. <laughs> if I'm gonna lose my YouTube channel, guys, it was, uh, it was a fun time. <laughs> um... Rook e8. As black, what's your favorite uh, opening for beginners uh, against d4? I said it many times. It's the reversed um, reverse London system, so Slav defense. I have a playlist on that. It has like five videos. So by the way, guys, just la one last call, okay, for potentially any new viewers in case you have a chessable account or own my London system course, uh, feel free to give me your vote for the course of the year by using the link from the chat. That would be like very much appreciated. That would really make my day, honestly. <laughs> uh, okay, some battery ideas. I would we'll do this, but that's kind of hanging the pawn, so I'll have to restrain myself from that. Okay, this is getting weird. D5. If you want a classical game from a completely lost position, I mean, that's... Not very unusual. I mean, that happens more often than you'd think. Especially if your opponent is in time trouble, it's, I mean, even in my uh, last um, kind of important tournament when I scored my IM norm, the last IM norm, I won against like a 2100 uh, with black from like a completely busted position. So, I mean, the guy was a bit older, he was playing slow. I mean, I knew how bad I played, but I just played fast and then uh, came with some tricks. Thank you for that, Paul. Appreciate it. Glad to help. Oh my God, this is going to be tough to get an attack with his, uh, with his pieces over there. By the way, this, this 800, man. This guy for an 800, he's, he's playing super solid. <laughs> Mr. Naffin. I don't know what he's after, but he's being super solid. If I take, there's like queen c7, that one, like, do it. Dang it. I don't know, I'm probably gonna lose this game, guys. That happens when you play bad. You gotta get used to it. Oh, never mind. He's actually <laughs> not really paying attention to the board, which is helpful sometimes. Just important not to rush with the checks, and I think just uh, do this little trick, stopping it too. So now when Queen H1 happens, it's actually a checkmate, so. 
Hey, thank you for the vote, Simon. Really appreciate it. Just wanted to say thank you for the thumbnails ideas. Dude, what do you mean? Like, are you legit telling me straight up that you're stealing ideas from my thumbnails? That is not very nice of you. But there you go, I guess. <laughs> um. Okay, let's, uh, this game. Yo, thank you for the votes, guys, Michael and Robert. Appreciate that. Okay, guys, I think um, this is probably going to be last game of the stream. So uh, appreciate you hanging out in the chat. Give me a vote if you haven't already from the pinned comment and... Uh, yeah, I'll try to stream kind of regularly, so if you haven't got a game today, just uh, make sure to, like, hmm, I don't know, turn on the bell so you get notified whenever, like, post or stream, so we can do these things kind of regularly. I mean, I hope so. Oh, this guy's actually playing my course against me. What the fuck? Dude, that is too strong. How am I even supposed to deal with this? Oh my. Okay, let's see if he knows this. Not gonna stream League? Guys, my League of Legends uh, game is not in a state where it can be streamed. I swear, as much as I would love to... <laughs> You'd probably change your opinion about me if you see me playing League of Legends. <laughs> Do you care about trying to become a GM? I mean, I already answered this. Um, what courses do you recommend for beginners? I, mean, I recommend my London course. I think that's like uh, <laughs> pretty good for beginners too. Oh, my opponent said that's all I've got. I only got it today. <laughs> All right, all right, all right. That's fair enough. <laughs> That's fair enough. I mean, still. This should be okay, but after C5, uh, the trick is to take. That's interesting for white. This is supposed to be just okay for black. Okay, D5. I think generally we're happy to see this opening up the bishop. Now, not super sure where to go with the knight, because e5 is kind of dubious. Probably just knight back. I'm playing on my main account, guys, right now. This is the link to it. You can, like, add me to your friends list, I guess. Um, how do we get developed? Like, bishop g4 is a thing, knight bd7 is a thing. Don't really care about the bishop here that much here, I would say. I just want to get developed. We have a bit less space. What's your elo in league? I'm, uh... I'm bronze for right now, guys, but I've been uh, gold for at my peak, so... <laughs> you know how it goes. You know, rating is temporary, but class is permanent. You know what they say. I can say the same about my league skills. Hey, thank you for that, Luke. Really appreciate the kind words. Vote where? Guys, you can vote me in the... Guys, are you, like, not even, like, listening to the stream? I've been, like, literally saying this for, like, the last two hours. You can vote me in the pinned comments on Chessable for, like, course of the year. That would be... If there's any way you want to, like, support me, that's that's the way to do it. <laughs> rematch in league. <laughs> Opponents asking for a rematch in league. Um, well, that's either underestimating my league potential or he is very good, but I don't know which one to think. Maybe a little bit of both. Um, 
B4. But I still have in quite a fine position. I only play uh, jungle guys. Otherwise, I'm just trolling, so. <laughs> I only play jungle in League of Legends. <laughs> Thank you for the vote, Craig. Really appreciate that. That's very kind of you guys. For those of you that took the time and voted, you know, that is very much appreciated and that makes me very happy. Pull a poll on who voted. I mean, I, I trust you guys. No need for the poll. I'm going to go with the trust. I prefer to be happy, not informed. You know? Like when you can check out uh, <laughs> your girlfriend's... I mean, I mean, you guys don't have girlfriends, but let's say when you can check out your partner's phone, you either be you can be informed or you can be happy if you don't check it. So you make your own choices whether you want to be happy or informed <laughs> so okay just uh, take uh poor opponent's pieces oh he pre-moved that oh no way <laughs> got him with the flag all right good game opponent um yeah just for the record you were supposed to go dc5 but uh, i'm pretty sure you'll find out about that so thanks for the games anyways uh All right, guys, so I think that was basically it for the stream. Thanks a lot uh, for hanging out. Uh, I mean, just an additional uh, plug. If you're already, uh, yeah, if you're not already in the Discord, I mean, I could just give you the Discord link real quick if you want to join. We have like 300 members there already. So if you've got like questions or I don't know, want to look for like opponents in your rating range, maybe play some training games. That potentially could find somebody in the Discord, so you can join it uh, using the link from the chat. And uh, yeah, I'll see you around. Maybe we'll stream uh, more often. Still gotta like come up with some videos, but uh, hopefully, we can have like these streams maybe like once or twice a week. So thanks for tuning in, and uh, 